All right, kind of setting up the testimony for Elon Musk. We believe he might actually testify in this trial. So let's talk a little bit more about this. Joining me right now, legal analyst Dr. Tracy Pearson, who was kind enough to be with us for the next three, <laughs> excuse me, three hours as we break down this case. So Dr. Pearson, good to see you. Um, Isaac Baruch's testimony was critical here uh, for a number of, of different reasons. What was your overall take on, on whether or not how, and how much he helped Johnny Depp's case? I think he helped Johnny Depp's case considerably. He was very credible. Um, he had a lot of detailed memory. Um, I, I, while he he does have some some you know potential for bias because of the financial support, I think that was overlooked by his honesty and in, in sort of his genuineness. Um, he, he was quite tearful towards the end of his testimony, and uh, you know was was even handed in 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 what he was saying in in that moment. He was also very entertaining. Um, at one point, talking about how he had kissed Amber Heard on the cheek, and uh, with counsel saying, "Well, did you do both cheeks?" and he said, "No, I'm, I'm, you know, from New York. I'm not European," and that, you know, mustered a laughter from the courtroom. Yeah, he was definitely a colorful witness, which is great. Keeps everybody informed. Keeps everybody attentive. And it was important because he did also support the uh, uh, Johnny Depp's team's narrative in their opening statement that Amber Heard might have faked this punch, you know, kind of joking around with her sister, laughing about it, and, and makes the jury wonder, well, was she laughing about it because she made it up and she's going to get Johnny Depp? And this is what the story that's being created by Johnny Depp's team. Let's take a very quick break. When we come back, we have a lot more to talk about here on the network. Stay tuned. We'll be back.